Hello everybody and welcome back to Workers and Resources. Um, <clears throat> I enjoyed that little speed build on the last episode, that was fun that. I'm going to do some more of them. Um, we're going to be building with a construction crew pretty much everything from now on so there's going to be opportunities to do a few little uh, high speed videos. Um, I didn't want to I didn't want to build in high speed when I'm planning things out um, because I wanted to talk through what I'm doing. I did see somebody do a high speed video of of this and I was struggling to keep up with it. I, I didn't know what to do. I, I kind of got lost after a little while and I think building, even though it's very very slow progress, um, which is too slow for a lot of people, judging by the viewer numbers, there's hardly anybody watching. Um, but I'm going to stick with it because I, 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 I like it. I'm really enjoying it. Um, it's a great game. It's got a lot of potential. I think there's a heck of a lot of potential for some of the things that they said they're coming out with on the roadmap. Um, I think it was Archivec said about nuclear power. That's coming. Um, there's going to be planes, helicopters, boats. Um, there's going to be new industries, car industries coming next. Um, there's going to be uh, more buildings, more decorative items. It's, there's, there's a load, load more stuff to come with this yet. And even already, it's so it's such a vast game. It's brilliant. It's it's really good. And I only recently found out that it's a one-man developer. Uh, one person has made this game, <coughs> which I'm. I'm really surprised by I thought it would have been a, a team of people I think it's I think it's an incredible achievement um, and I, I do I really, I'm really enjoying it it's got its quirky quirky bits it's got its little fireballs little things wrong here and there that need sorting out but I can get over that I'm not that bothered about that right um I've put a pub in down here and a, a tennis court and a football pitch just for these Houses. I'm going to have to go and do a bit more around here. Uh, these can't reach the school or the kindergarten, so we're going to need a, a school and a kindergarten somewhere. Now we've got one right there. I did connect up various paths here and there, but it's, it still hasn't reached. Um, I'm just wondering if a bus will take them. It might do. However, this bit we built yesterday. Um, if you notice I've put a road in and I've pre-flattened a little bit of area there. I'm going to lower that down a slight bit. I want to redo, remove this so I'm going to have to pay for this. I'm going to pay for some buildings around here. Uh, and the reason being is because these lot have got no shops, no food, no clothes. <laughs> There's only three people. Everybody left. <laughs> um, if you look at last month. We had 120 people escape last month. That's more than last year. I had 66 all last year. Um, so we've already had 32 gold this month as well. So they've all uh, they've all absconded. So that's all right. Don't really matter. I've still got nearly 7,000 people. So the population's going up anyway. Um, I'll go and grab a few more people and repopulate them flats at some point soon because <laughs> that's the uh, that's the workforce for this mine there's only 20 people working up there at the moment how much are you producing nothing 0 0.28 tons oh that's gone up five six I think you need to get the game going to in order to well yeah when you start the game up if you're in pause nothing's working so you start the game going to get everything <coughs> running. Right, so these people need access to stuff. So we're going to have another little sort of town square area here. Um, the main, the roads and the main buildings, sort of the pub, the shops and things like that, I'm going to, I'm going to have to pay for because <coughs> we need them in quickly. Uh, but once they're in, I'm going to go and put a load more flats in and we'll get the construction crew working on them. There was a bit of a hold up from the uh, concrete plant. That's what was holding stuff up last time. Um, and the reason being is because it's not getting cement. I had to auto buy a little bit. 
and that's because the cement's all being picked up and taken out by these trucks. So I've sent the cement train back to the depot. The steel train's in there as well, so we're going to restock. Oh, let me just pause for a second. Right, sorry. Um, where was I? Sorry, I just got a phone call and I've forgotten where I was up to. Um, the trains are in here. Yeah, they're stuck there waiting. We're restocking. Um, I've got the trucks waiting here. They're taking the steel up to this. They're starting to restock that steel a little, little bit. Um, this is waiting on more coal. This is waiting on more gravel. Uh, gravel's a little bit of a problem at the moment. We're not producing anywhere near enough. Even with five gravel plants on here. Um, probably do with a bit more staff just to speed that up a bit. These people... A few of them have left. They all seem... That one's nearly full. Oh, I brought a few people into those, that's why. Um, there's people dying as well. I've had 153 deaths this month. 410 this year and we're only in February. 2,000 people died last month but there were 2,800 births so there is there is a population increase going on. The only thing is they're all uneducated children at the moment. <laughs> um, and we need an educated workforce to work in the, uh, work in the various industries. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, I need to restock. Yeah, that's what I was talking about, the cement. Um, the cement trucks are still on here. Uh, they're still filling up this silo. What I'm going to do, I've, I've set them all to wait until unloaded. So once this fills up, 270 tonnes, I'm not going to send the train straight away. Um, give me the thing, he, he can carry 280 anyway, so... Uh, once this is filled up, I'm hoping it's going to fill this up. I could just send all them trucks back for the time being. I'm just thinking whether to send them to the depot. Yeah, actually, go to the depot. Go and wait at the depot for a bit. I want to, um, I need to get some cement in that building. Go on, go to the depot. I've done those ones. I'm sure there was one left. No, I've done them all. Right, um I just wanna see now if the cement goes through into this building or whether it's just going to sit in here I think it's just going to sit in here it looks like it oh this is not good I mean this will grab cement out of here but it needs to be in the silo and those trucks are clearing the silo out as fast as we're making it Oh well, um, yeah, cancel that. <laughs> Do I want to cancel it? In fact, no, let's, oh, sorry, I'm <laughs> Mr. Indecisive today. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to send them all back for a little bit. I'm going to let this fill up um, because we're going to need cement on the next construction job. And my money's going down because I'm importing iron and I've got no train sitting here at the moment just these trucks are uh, slowly filling up I say slowly filling up, there's only one in there, the other three must be on the way or on the way back at least, anyway there's one no that's a... Uh, yeah, carrying steel, excellent right so I need to fill this up as well Right, um, so 
sorry, I just had a little break there. Um, I don't know why I'm apologising. It's not like you've been sat here waiting for me to come back. <laughs> um, where were we up to? Okay, so I need to go and do a bit of work up here. And I need to get this. This a bit more finished off. And um, once I get the shops in, I'm going to put a brick factory down here. I'm going to start exporting bricks. Um, so we're just going to... I'm going to load these up for a bit. I've already said all this. Um, I'm going to load the steel up for a bit and try and get some stored in here. Try and get this full because we're going to need it. 59 tons in there now. Before we do that, let's, um, let's have a look at this. There's a big hill here. Maybe if I average it out. try and soften this. I'm going to have to move that power thing. We're on pause, aren't we? Hang on. Get rid of that, please. Get rid of this wireframe for a second. Let's take that back to about there. Remove this road. Let's not remove that bit. Let's just upgrade that. Um. Yeah, I'm going to pay for that. I didn't see how much that was, <laughs> but we need um. I need things in here. Let's get rid of that rubble. Get that roll sorted out. Oops. Go on, get rid of that. That's a big black lump. <laughs> sorry, sorry about my dog's barking in the background. I'm not barking out, charging around. Um, right. So we need a couple of shops. We need a pub. Uh, we need a kindergarten and a school. I'm thinking if I take the road, the road up here, that's not going to let me connect up onto there though. Should be doing this with the grid on. Sorry if you can hear the nutcase in the background <laughs> charging about. Um, try and go. I just give me that straight there. There we go. <clears throat> right. Let's uh, let's get this bit levelled. Kind of. Do an average. Oh, in here we need. I think they're all right for pub. There's a pub there. And they'll reach all of them. They're only 167 at maximum, so they should reach around this side as well to the pub. Once we get a few paths in the middle as well, we should be all right there. I'm not putting another shopping centre in, I think we'll just have to stick with some small shops. We'll put them down here near the bus station. Sorry, come on. Flash green as soon as I went over it. Come on, I saw you. <laughs> is there somewhere? There it is. Yes, is there enough room to get that footpath out of the back of it? I hope so. Right, grocery store, small store. Leave a gap in the middle. Right, we're alright for a pub, aren't we? Yeah. Um, so anyway, I'm not going <clears> to... <throat> it's the shops, really, more than anything. That's why people are leaving, because they're not getting... 
food. I was just wondering what that was there. I have just remembered I've put in um put in a statue. It should have a road on it. That should have a path on it. I thought it was connected up. Where? Do that. <clears throat> what about the others? Yeah, I've put a couple of statues in, so... Right, um... Education, please. Let's get to the kindergarten. Can we get a school in this bit? Can't build building due to infrastructure. I wanted to put flats down this side because they're going to be closer to the bus station. I don't really want it over this side. I wanted it in here. Tool tip. Getting him away. Maybe if I get rid of the bit of that road. Oh, I haven't set my timer recording. I haven't my timer off either. Hang on, sorry. Just want to know how long I've been recording for. Right, you can build there. If I can get the terrain flattened out. Come on. This does go a lot quicker if you're on fast forward, but it also uses up fuel as well. So... Do here. School's in. Right, there's no way we're going to be able to squeak that in here now. This side somewhere. that again but straight <laughs> on the grid I'll leave room for a few flats in here and there let's let's get all this built it's expensive but I can't afford to wait for it I need to get people back in here. I need to get. I need to get that mine. I'm not going to build that one just yet. Um, <clears throat> I need to get that mine staffed so that we got coal coming in because that's what's holding us back on the money at the moment is a lack of coal. Yeah. Right. Let's see what damage that's done. Watching my money going down. <laughs> down, 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 deeper and down. What about you? You're not built. Let's get these shops built. I thought I just clicked on them. Right. Let's get a few paths. Right, we're going to auto build these because. Otherwise, we'd just be waiting too long for them. Um, can we get a path down here? Squeak through there, yeah. takes so long because you're clicking and clicking and clicking. <laughs> right, this path's there, they're going to get built by the game. 
Right, you can get to all of them. Right, next thing I need to do is go and get some more people. Restock this. Let's go and find a donor town. Hello, country folk. Where are we? There we go. I think I might have cleared this one out already. 26 there. 20 in that one. How many flats we got? We've got six, so... I need to get most of these. Get move some people in from across the nation. It's already open. Those two. Oh, I reckon that'll be plenty. I won't restock a few other buildings as well while we're at it. Just to um, <coughs> just to re repopulate the from the escapees, right? Sorry if it's very frantic at the moment. When you've got all these windows open, it starts getting really laggy. Um, you lot get in there. You lot in there, please. What's that doing now? 44, right. Get another 22 in there. Leave some room for some kids. <coughs> There's something else I need to do as well. I'm going to go and put a... I'm going to go and put a bus going into the town so that they can get to the cinema. I didn't... Look how many people are in there now. 59, I'll leave that one. Yeah, I suppose you could say this is cheating, but... <laughs> well, it's not really, they were, you know. People did get moved across. <laughs> did get relocated in Russia. <laughs> go, and, uh, go and work. <laughs> Either that or to a gulag. <laughs> Not even funny, I'm not laughing at I wasn't laughing at that. Um I was just thinking about something I seen on another video. Uh, how are you doing now? Forty eight. Let's get a couple more in there. Uh fifty eight. Go in that one now. Oh you got twenty in there, right. That's forty one. And that makes oh get it right that makes 68 right so we have glorious people we have no electricity ah. of course I took the thing out without putting it back in <coughs> substation just scroll out a little bit here I need to be able to get to that school so needs to face that way around. That block of flats we need to get to, that one that's going on and off there. As you can see it's not lit up. The one next to it is though. So just about there I think. I know I just paid for the, some flattening but it was only cheap. Now I've got to try and find the end of the wire. There it is. Get them lit up. There we go. <coughs> We're all lit up. Right. Bus, 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 bus. Stick with these ones. You're going to go from here to there. Set you off. I think I'll put two on that actually. Copy the schedule. Did I not just... I thought I just bought another bus. Hang on a second. 
Right, that is underneath it. <laughs> Excuse me. Right. Just pause it a second. Let's go back up to the bus stop. Right, you're going to now accept passengers and students. I need to get these buses again. No, you're the construction yard bus. These ones. And I need to tell these... How do I tell these? There we go, right, okay. So, we don't want workers. We want students, children, children, passengers. Do the same at the other end. Right, now we need to go and find the... Um, actually, well, while we're at it, let me just turn this on for passengers and students as well. Now, you there, you want to be workers only. Oh. I'm just wondering, do the mines need educated workers? Where does it tell you? Let's have a look to see if it tells you there. University education, basic education. Seems everyone in that one's got at least a basic education. What about this one over here? That's an engine transfer. <laughs> Where's the other mine? Oh, it's that one. Yeah, so it looks like basic education. If we leave workers without education. Right, let's um, now I need to go find the other buses. Right, there's one, there's one, and there's the other. Right, so they should be just picking up workers now, educated workers. Yeah, oh, I need to go and do the same down at this station with these buses. There's a bit of a weird bit of texture there, there's not a lot I can do about it though. <laughs> well, there's nothing I can do about it. Right, so... Got him on educated workers. We'll copy that to that one, and that one, and that one. Now then, with any luck... <laughs> that hopefully will work. We've got some passengers waiting, so... Uh, yeah, we can reach the bus station from there. I bet you I'm not going to be able to flatten this down. I don't think I can. Hmm. Does that look like it's actually going down? Just a little bit. I'm just wondering if I can get enough room in here to get a get a block of flats in, or at least a few box blocks of flats. <coughs> Sorry, I'm going quiet because I'm thinking. Um, right. Let's get rid of that a second. Okay, so... Lofsky's got a second kindergarten and a school. This bus here... There. Can we tell you can't tell you to do anything? No, right, that's fine. 
That is selects um that is choosing to pick up people from here. I'm just wondering whether I'd be better off picking them up from here. In fact I think I think that is a good plan. Um Because that way then it's not sabotaging the the main mine, this one with the most workers in. So I'll get them from here instead. From here, sorry, that's the petrol station you're pointing at. I think I'm going to go and get rid of that road. <clears throat> Rather than having them build it and then me having to delete it again afterwards. Um, right, so that's sorted out. What did I need to do down here? I've put there's some paths need going in, but they're gonna the game's gonna build them. They shouldn't take too long because they're only uh, the gravel. This construction yard's got yeah loads of jobs. Footpath, footpaths. I want to build. Um, separate storage yards for this rather than just having one and then we can get rid of that and maybe get another construction yard in between hopefully so what I was thinking of doing is having like have an area here with four big ones and then we can have separate ones for each one then that will save trucks queuing up here later on because there's only two spaces there and they're all going to start getting in one another's way. How are we doing on cement? Right, we've got 82 tonnes in there. Um, I don't think there's any steel here. How much have we got up here? 82 tonnes. I think I'm going to set these trains and trucks back off again. We're getting rather low on money. And it's going to be... A while until they fall. I'm not going to spend any more now, though. Boop. Off you go. Hopefully, yeah, they're coming out of separate tracks. He's still got a little bit of steel on. He's got 11 tons on board. I think he had... Yeah, he's got 89 tons of cement. That's good. Right, and there's some weight in here, I think. So there's 20 tons there already. Good. <coughs> you? What happened there? <laughs> Right, so, 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 so. What do we want to do next? I could probably do with more housing up here, so I think we'll get some. We'll get the game building some flats. Not gonna let me stick any in there. What about over here on this side? Oh, one there. What about another one over here? It'll do there if I get rid of the... That, that's even better. Get rid of that footpath. I saw you. I saw you. Oh, come on. Stop being so awkward. <laughs> Flattens it a little bit and then say no. Go on. There we go. Oh, there we go. Right, can I get one more in here? Oh, just, just squeak that one in there. 
Might be able to if I flatten that out a little bit. I thought I was paying for it then. <laughs> Panic moment. I can get one there, but it's a bit too... I want it... At least the same sort of distance as the other one is. I don't want them too rammed up too close to one another. Maybe if I shrink this down a bit. Let's try, let's try lowering this bit. I'm not having it because of this texture, this rock. No, I don't think we're getting one in there. We'll get one this way around here. Purple? No. those and do them a bit better. <laughs> too close to the school. Let's see if I can get that rolled in now. <laughs> Education, education, no, not education, housing, residential, that's what we want. <coughs> I'm going to leave this for the time being because I might put something else in there. I might have a statue in there or something. I don't know. <laughs> Thinking I probably want these lined up, but... I might just leave it for now because... We might need to get out, uh, might need to expand even more over here. I just want to get a dirt road in here. Out oh, this way then. Okay. Right, let's just get this path back in. way to walk up there. Yeah, I'll leave that for some decorating in a bit. Um, get this connected up. Money's well, going down. Run out of money soon. I don't want to run out of money because if I run out of money, then that means the shops are not getting food and stuff. Um, so yeah, I don't want to let the rubles get to zero. That's quite imperative. And there's, I can't. There's no way I can afford to get the electric over there at the moment. Cost too much money to get it get it sent that way. Um, I think I'm going to go and watch these get built. Might do another little one of those speedy videos. <laughs> Before I plan anything else out, um, we have got some building projects down here as well. 
get this these paths bought because they're only cheap. Just don't want to have too many construction jobs on the go on the go at the same time because there's quite a lot of just waiting around for things to turn up and Whereas if you're building more localised in one area, there's a lot more activity going on around you. So I don't want to bring in workers all the way from up there down to this area. That's why I'm paying for bits and pieces here now. Um, you know, you get built. Oh, how much was that? That was 10 grand. That was a bit silly. Right, are there any more paths there that need building? I don't think so. What about you there? You unfinished road, you get built. Bob. You're built. Um, there is a statue there which I'm going to suspend for the moment. There's only one there, that's one. I'm going to suspend that one. Get that path built. Get this path built. I'm just... I just don't want any of my workforce coming down here. Just try to think if I put another statue in. can't believe I've just spent 10 grand on a statue. <laughs> I'm running out of money. How much have you got on board? 11 grand. Go. Go, go, go. How much have you got on board? 14 grand, right. Go. A pair of you, get gone. Go and get me some money. Right, it's 37 tons in there, okay. As long as there's some in here, then my cement tanks can. Uh, yeah, my concrete tr trucks can come and get concrete. I don't want to buy in cement, that's a ridiculous thing when I'm making it. <coughs> uh, how are we doing on here? Passengers waiting, that's alright. I was looking at uh, some people statistic bits and pieces nonsense. If you look, if you see there, it says working shift, so it shows, that, it shows you the 8 hour working shift are on. But that does go over 8 hours, I've noticed. I've, I've seen people going in 9 hours on the working shift. But then the free time is 16 hours. So, they've got 16 hours to get rest, get food, get clothing, get to the cinema, do what they need to do, um, play a few sports. That's what we haven't got here. I'll oh, go on. You stick a tennis court in there for me. Don't pay for it. Oh, there it is. Can we get a football pitch in instead? Yeah. I'll stick that on the to do list. So we just let's get these paths built. Paths are all cheap, so and that hooked up. <laughs> just saying about not spending money. <laughs> Who doesn't spend money on loads of paths? They're only, they're, not, they're only a few hundred rubles then, because all they are gravel. I know I'm making gravel, but it doesn't matter. How much are you? 987 sold. We'll have that. Um, just thinking what I want to do next. I know it was a little bit inefficient sending them while they're not full, especially this one. But he has got 15 grand on board, so that'll put us back up to 35. Um, 
gives chance for these trucks to get a little bit of steel as well while he's down there. And he's in here. Little three waiting. Oh. I wish they'd kind of. I don't know. I wish you could set orders for the filling. You know, like fill one, two, three, four in order. So then one truck could get full, but because he's sort of filling a little bit each one. Which means you're waiting for stuff. Um, I'm just waiting for this to get done. What's going on? How are you going so slow? Was there any workers here? There isn't any workers here. I think I'm going to go and have to set that up in this one again. Good old students waiting. <laughs> We might have to put another bus on there. Right, you there, you get your workers. No, no, leave them, leave them, leave them, leave them. Coming from down here, they'll walk onto the building sites anyway. There were loads of people walking onto these building sites on the last one. They're all going to the college, to the school. That's something we're going to need as well, the university. I haven't even got a hospital yet. I possibly put a hospital here. We'll move that petrol station somewhere else. <laughs> it's been moved so many times out already. I think maybe put a hospital here. Um, how big are they? They're not that big. Hi station. Yeah, hospital. I'm thinking putting it, putting it right there and then we can have more sort of housing around the back here. <clears throat> Possibly get another cinema in over here somewhere and then put housing around the back and down the, down the side. We've still got this area to expand into as well. Wasn't you supposed to be going building a new town? <laughs> Not yet. I want to get um, I want I want to get these built so I can go and work on the brick factory. That's what we're going to do next. Right, I don't want to lay them in just yet because <coughs> it means switching them all off and then having to go and switch them all back on again manually. Right, let's wait for this to get built. I'm going to uh, yeah, I'm I'll jump into a little speedy thing, stick a bit of music on. All right, I'll be back in a bit.
so we got them built eventually. <laughs> um, how much money we got? We got 48 grand. I did have to send this train off. He's back. Back and he's loading up. Yeah, I had to send him off partially full. He's filling up. <clears throat> and I've had to set this back to auto purchase again just so we can keep the cement on the go. Um, I need to redo this, but I just haven't got the money to do it. And I don't want to rebuild another one somewhere else. Um, so, the next job is a brick factory, which is here. And that needs coal. Well, this is our coal supply. Which of course is on the same side as the road connection. <laughs> oh, don't auto purchase. Just thinking, I wonder if I flatten this area out here. Yeah. Get this flattened out a bit and then. Uh, and push it a little bit further back, leaving room for houses. <laughs> people are gonna. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of pollution around near where people are living. Right, let's um, let's get the brick factory in here. Where's the? We've got a footpath connection at the front there. That's good. Let's leave room to squeeze a little road through. Um. I have to get the trucks in and out as well. That does look like it's a high up connection, so hoping hopefully I can squeeze a road out from underneath it. Um we're gonna need a storage yard next to it. Oh so these store bricks. I have a small one. <coughs> Let's get the brick factory. Where are you? Oh, let's just push it over this way a little bit. Try and get it as flush with that road as I can. Right, let's try there. Um, I'm going to auto purchase the road. I'm just going to do a gravel one. I should have perhaps built this in planning mode. <laughs> Would like a nice curve on that, but I don't think it's going to let me. Um, right. Storage yard. Small open storage here. Wondering how far I can actually move it, put this. Try there. <laughs> Don't know if that'll connect. Oh, well. Do it rather ugly, but how much is that? Two thousand nine hundred rubles for that connection. I'll let them build it. What's it need? Gravel and asphalt. I'll let them build it. Let's just pause it a second. Um, the wireframe off because I need to go tell the the boss. Not to pick people up from there. Come down here instead. That's too far to bring workers all the way down there. Um, I 
Right, uh, gravel, 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 gravel. Don't need a gravel road. Already purchasing that one, aren't we? <laughs> he was bringing gravel. Are you going to turn around? Oh, he's going to go this one. Um, right, I think... with another one of them storage yards in here. I was thinking if I could squeeze one in there. <clears throat> now it doesn't matter. Oh it does matter because we need to drop the bricks off at the... I was thinking we could drop them straight off at the... Um train station but we can't ah these power cables in there are we paused we are All right, let's get rid of them power cables make sure I remember to put them in this time put them back in this time <laughs> small storage please sorry about that <laughs> little coughing fit there I don't think this is going to connect you know Try it. Oh, please. Oh, just yes. <laughs> right, so then we'll have a, a truck just running bricks back and forward. Um, we'll put a gravel road across there. Go on. Just get it to there then. There we go. Right, so brick factory. Let's um, move that road off the back of there because we don't need it round there. What we do need is a conveyor coming to there. Just double check that this is coal. Yeah, it is, yeah. Um, <laughs> no chance. <laughs> if I move them power lines, I will be able to. And that reminds me. <laughs> Nearly forgot. Um, If I could squeeze this round. This way a little. Building in the way. Right, let's take that back a second. Go that way then. Where we need to get up to. I think it's this one here, isn't it? Isn't it? <laughs> yeah, there we go. Right, go over that way. Oh, we're gonna have to pay for them. Right, that's two and a half grand, that's alright, it's not too much. Um Let's make sure that's got power. <clears throat> Yeah, there we go. And go and tell them to build those connections. Streets. Right, I'm going to let it run on, build that, and then um, I think that'll be the end of the episode because it's going to be quite long. Right, I'll do a little speedy build at the end and then next episode we'll come and get some houses round here and get this built up a bit more. Alright, thanks everybody again for watching. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up there. Um, give me a like <laughs> if you enjoyed this one, if you're still watching. Those glorious few who are. And uh, I'll see you next time for another one. Probably tomorrow. Alright, bye.